Hey guys, this is Joe Papanon, and today I got another My Hero Academia pop. This is the week of My Hero Academia. We go long stretches without anything from certain properties, and then all of a sudden, bam, 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 uh, we get a whole bunch. And of course, the one I got today was Mount Lady. Uh, I was able to go pick her up. Um, I got her, and I am really um, impressed with her. She looks really good, very true to the character. I am just so surprised that we got Mount Lady. Uh, she is a very, um, not big character in the show. She's just a random new hero you meet in episode one. Uh, you hardly see her. She shows up in like the, um, a couple episodes. Um, her main thing she does is she um, saves them from um, all for one at that one scene. Like pretty much she uses her giant body as a blocking device. And... That, which I have to say was really cool. Um, but but besides that, she's not a really big character. So I'm really surprised they didn't go with one of the teachers. Because uh, there's a whole bunch of teachers, other students, um, just another villain. Just lots of characters I would have really guessed above her. Because she's just not a very... Well, she's a big character. But uh, she's not a very like, big one for the show. Uh, I guess she's more of a fan favorite. Um which I can absolutely see, um, but uh, they did a great job. She's really well designed. She has a very big head. I hope she stands well. Um, but here, let's take a look. Of course, she was from Hot Topic. They did a nice job getting her in. Uh, there was no problems, at least for me, finding one. Uh, they had multiples and everything like that for people who wanted more than one. Um, but I... I I'm impressed, and I'm ready to see, um, looking forward to see her um, out of box. Yeah, because this one's just very different. Um, at least to me, I think it looks different. Uh, she's, she's we really, I don't think I've, I have another 10-inch pop with such a large head and a little body. Um, because, once again, she's a female character, and a lot of the female characters have, like, little feet and stuff like that. And in comparison to the rest of her, her feet are quite small. Uh, so she comes in a nice double-sided one, clamshell. And, oops, where did it go? My apologies for that. The stand had fallen. <laughs> Rolled a little. They can get some distance sometimes. All right, so here we go. We got Mount Lady. Here, let's see how her stand fits, because she comes with a nice big stand, because once again, as I said, she has a very big head, especially with all that hair, and she has, in comparison to the rest of her, little feet. Uh, these stands are so hard sometimes to get in, and I just pray, most of the times, the peg does not break off, because that happened to one of my pops, and it actually, the while trying to kind of squeeze it in there, the peg actually snapped off in their foot, which was wonderful. Just wonderful. Um, so... Here we go. We got Mount Lady. She looks quite nice. I am really impressed. She looks just like she does in the show. Uh, they did a really good job with her hair. Like, to be honest, most of her, like, what you're seeing and stuff is her hair. <laughs> uh, is a big part of her. And she looks really good. I kind of love that she's doing the little peace sign because she's just kind of a, a character. She just wants to be the most popular and um get ahead <laughs> but she looks great I, I really like this one so we're going to lower this down and we're going to take a look at her in comparison to one of the normal size uh my hair pops give me one moment so excellent so this is mount lady in comparison to some of the normal sized my hero academia pops as you can tell like because all might is just so huge as a normal pop he's almost the height of her uh, very close. And then we got like Deku, who's just the average height uh, one for the group. And so he's, as you can tell, he's is quite smaller. I'm surprised they didn't make her, well, I'm not really surprised because uh, she would take up a lot of room as a 10 inch pop, but she would have made more sense as a 10 inch pop because she is just the size of a building pretty much in comparison to the rest of the heroes. Unlike this one where she's pretty much, excuse me, almost the same size as All Might. Um, which just kind of makes her look like she's just a big, strong lady. But um, in this, like, she's she's a giant. Um, 
and I don't know. I, I think she looks really nice. Uh, she fits very well with the line, um, except for her, as I said, for her size. I would think she would she should be a lot taller. Like she should be like probably to here or <laughs> she should really be double her height. Uh, but I like her. She's good. Um, she look once again her her design on her is quite flawless. Like it looks just like Mount Lady. Uh, <laughs> uh, so here we go. Let's take a look at her, the sides and we'll compare them to the other ones. So you just get a good size comparison with her um, right next to them. But I have to say I love that they're doing the My Hero um, ones more at Hot Topic. Uh, we got another one. I believe it's next week. I could be mistaken. Uh, they have just so many um, that are coming out for the holiday season. Um, but uh, I'm really, I really like it that they've done a couple of My Hero Academia ones for their exclusives because I really and they're new characters. So I am completely stoked to get all of them because I'm like, yes, a new character, a show I love. Um, absolutely, sign me right up. So here, let me pop this back up and let's take another look. Excellent. So this was my little review of Mount Lady. She looks great. They did a really nice job. They um, really did. Uh, I have to say a lot of people think her outfit's quite scandalous because it kind of doesn't look like because her hair color is almost the same color as her outfit. Kind of like All Might's uh, 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 teacher suit. Um, but for her, hers is like skin tight and so it looks very provocative. But it's not. It's completely covered up. So... Um, but this one is really nice. I love the horns that they have on her. Everything looks really nice. And with the stand, um, the peg is a little tight. I'm not sure if other people are going to have the same problem. It's always better, uh, to be honest, if the peg is a little tight than not because I have a couple, once again, that like, it comes with a stand because they know the pop can't really stand on its own. But the peg is too tiny for the hole in their foot. And so they kind of rest on it, but then they fall over. But... Um, these one, this one does a really nice job. You can, pretty much you put it in once. Um, it's not really made to take on and off, on and off. Uh, but you get in there once and it's set. Like pretty much I might be able to get it in there just a slight bit more. Um, and she's all set. Um, but she looks great. Once again, um, I have now surpassed um, the shadow box for My Hero Academia, which is impressive for the line. Um, so I have to figure out something uh, to do with them. I got to show them off. I'm um, starting up an Instagram, guys, so um, I want to start showing off a bit more of my collection to you. Um, but they look, this one looks really good. I want to show off, like, so you guys can see my complete uh, My Hero line when I figure out how to um, show the, uh, I don't think a four now fit because of her. And it will be five very soon. <laughs> uh, but they look so good. Uh, maybe I should make a shelf of Deku. <laughs> uh, but she looks so good. She's a really nice size. I think it's kind of funny that she really is almost this, the size of All Might. Um, and once again, guys, if you do run out and grab her right now, it is hot cash time. So if you do have any more hot cash, um, you can pick her up like with one other pop and uh, you can use the hot cash. Uh, works perfectly. Um, highly recommend doing that. That's what I did for her. Um, but she looks so nice. Um, any My Hero fan will definitely need to get uh, Mount Lady uh, for their collection because they just did a wonderful job and they just really, it just speaks for itself just by seeing her. Um, she just is really, really good to the to the line and really, really spot on to what she looks like. They're doing such a good job with Funko, um, getting them to look just like themselves. So thank you all so much for tuning in. Please like, comment, and subscribe. It really, really, really helps. Um, and I greatly, greatly appreciate it. And um, this is Joe popping on, and I'm going to be popping off. Thank you guys so much. Doodles.